Hey guys, what's up Capricorn? Thanks for watching, appreciate it. This is going to be a reading for your immediate future, the situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. So keep in mind that the energies can go both ways. This could be your energy or the energy of the person you're dealing with, somebody around you. So let's look at how you need to. Also remember, it's a general reading. So just take the chores, leave the rest behind. If it does resonate, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. Also, you can check out the week ahead that breaks it down day by day. I'll put that link in the corner up here. Alright, Capricorn. If you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, that information is down below. Alright, media future for the caps. What's coming up, please? Immediate future for Capricorn. Thank you. We got three of Pentacles. The two of Pentacles. It's like trying to work towards a goal. And at the moment, or kind of around the energy, it might not seem all the way possible. It may seem like a little stuck, even maybe a little unachievable. It could be like a decision that's just not being made. It's a situation that's kind of came to a crossroads. So when you have the Three of Pentacles over here, somebody's trying to work towards something, work together, make something happen. This could be around work, career, partnerships, or just, I mean, a situation in general, something that somebody's trying to work towards. But it's been kind of stuck, but it's starting to move now with the Two of Wands. That Two of Swords is opening up. The light shining in type thing. Show me the three of pentacles, please. For Capricorn. Okay. The Queen of Swords could be dealing with the air sign. The Nine of Wands and the Nine of Swords. Somebody's trying to move towards something. This could be a round work, like I said. <clears throat> But moving towards this, there's some type of like challenge that has to be overcame. This is a very guarded energy, a very worried energy. This can also be somebody who gets like anxiety at a physical level. Very protective of self. Not exactly the most trusting energy, at least towards the situation. But with the Nine of Wands, that's like the Wounded Warrior. So it feels like there's a reason. It's, it's a down but not out energy. So something may have kind of knocked you back in this situation or just how in general there's some worry here show me this two of swords so with that anxiety that can that at least towards this this situation it's brought things to a two of swords it's like almost not seeing a way forward a way of like fixing things might not even be willing to talk. It depends what the situation is. That can be with the two of swords. Sometimes the heart chakra or the throat chakra can kind of get cut off. We don't trust. Our intuition can kind of close off. Um, have a hard time having like those conversations that are beneficial, with at least within the situation. Show me this two of swords, please, for Capricorn. It's kind of keeping things stuck. The world which is your energy and the nine of pentacles you're closing chapters here things are changing but um you could be very business focused very work career oriented your money is coming up you're putting some type of boundaries in place and there's a change coming that i don't think that you're quite seeing yet your finances are picking up incredibly with the nine and the ten of pentacles focusing on self your money your career you got the empress at the bottom you can overcome all these challenges, and you will. Don't let your mind tell you any different. But it's tricks on you sometimes. Show me this two of wands for the outcome for Capricorn, please. Because that's an amazing group of cards right there in the middle. You're making changes that, you know, are for your highest good. So for the outcome, you do have a choice there. Things are opening up. And you're walking, you're disconnecting from anything that's not giving you back that equal give and take. Aries energy with the emperor there, but it, it feels like you're really taking charge. Whereas there was something that was a struggle here, it feels like you're 
whether this, like I said, it doesn't really matter what angle it is. You're kind of putting your foot down. You're putting boundaries in place. Show me um, one more for the outcome for Capricorn. And with the Six of Pentacles, something may feel like a, a little one-sided or like you're not, you're not getting back to get the, uh, I'm going to say compensation, it's like for work, career, but in general, you know, um, you may not feel like you're getting back what you put into it. Because with the Eight of Cups there, it looks like you're making a choice to move in one direction and that may mean kind of pulling away from another direction. The opening up of, it's almost like a situation that felt kind of stuck there. All right, Capricorn, I hope this helps. If it resonated, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. If you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, that's below as well. You guys take care, and I will see you next time. Bye.